Hello YouTube! Today, we will do a video about the Mobile Legends Bang Bang Metallic Tumblers by 7-Eleven. So, okay, let's start with the cap. They went back to making soft rubbery caps. As you can see, you sh this was the usual caps for their Star Wars, Marvel, and their tumblers, their other tumblers. They usually had this, but on their Spider-Man release, it became a solid hard plastic cap. It's weird that they went back to this. And also, what's weird is that they already had, I'd like to say, a partnership with 7-Eleven a few months ago. Where if you bought Slurpee, you'd accumulate points and then you could get diamonds which is the real life currency in this game mobile legends it's a game for your mobile phone if it isn't obvious enough yes if it isn't obvious enough all right and what else um when they they had the promo already in the previous months i'm wondering why didn't they release this during that time? And the Spider-Man Trump tumblers just came out. And then there's some new ones. So yeah, I don't know what's up with that. But if I if I had to speculate, I think they planned to release this with their first promo with Slurpee. Because, as you can see, here we go, there's the logo of the 515 Unite, and there's Slurpee, Mountain, Mountain Dew, and 7-Eleven, because there's a Slurpee Mountain Dew, but for this one, it's Gulp. Also, with their other tumblers, they had, they had a lot of Star Wars tumblers, and they were all for Gulp. But for this one, it's for Slurpee. I think this is the first time we see a tumbler like this. It's similar to this. Yeah, it they feel like the same. The print is the only different part, and the cap, of course. So yeah. Also, what's different is the Slurpee, as I pointed out. So yeah. Wow! I already spent three minutes talking about stuff that maybe you don't want to know about okay now let's look at the tumbler it's they say it's a metallic tumbler um yeah kind of mia reflects one the best i think my light is too harsh for this yeah but as you can see it's kind of metallic but I think I don't want to advise you oops using this if you don't want the design to get scratched so just keep this for collection I think a lot of people are interested with this tumbler it it sells out fast unlike the spider-man tumblers there are still a lot yeah but this is still nice. It's interesting. It's the first time we, they did color changing gimmicks with the tumblers. This this time they're making metallic gimmick. Now this one is Gushion. Gushion or Gushion. I don't really know. I don't use this character. But I think he's a strong hero just that in the game they give you some heroes to start with but the others you need to buy um, with real life currency or by accumulating points and playing the game 
but yeah i haven't just bought him yet and i don't know what he does to be honest but i've had some allies and some enemies in the game using this character but yeah it's the five on five unite slurpy mountain Jew. what's this certified i can't read it certified filtered does it say certified filtered my eyesight is bad anyway who cares his background oops now it's out of focus it's kind of gray and light blue in real life in case my camera isn't picking it up well oh and interestingly there are what you call skins so this is not what Gusion or Gushon normally looks like um, you need to purchase the skin so he will look different and he'll get a uh, bonus stats in the game so he'll become stronger and he'll look more cool if you bought the skin this one this is the normal me and the others there they are in their normal versions all right now this one oh okay they made two marksmans mia is a marksman as you can see she has a bow and arrow and claude is also a marksman see mobile legends in real life i think i can't really describe the color um it's kind of like blue but when light shines on it it becomes violet that's his monkey i think i haven't also bought claude so i have no experience using him just like okay the only one that i have experience using with is mia because she's one of the heroes that's easy to get let's take a look at Claude oh he's holding something it's like the tesseract from the Avengers wow nice yeah and I talked too much now we are at we're about to reach eight minutes now this one is Fanny. Alright. I like her metallic background because it's a bright color like Mia's. Yeah, metallic looks really great with bright colors. There's a bird right there. There's a rock. Fanny's really beautiful. Yeah, let's take a good look at that again. Finally, I ran out of things to say. And there's 515 Slurpee. Oh, you can see my finger reflecting in this one. That's nice. So I think this one reflects the best. So yeah, let's take a look, good look at Claude again. Can you see my finger reflecting? Oh yes, you can. So it reflects a bit. You can see his arm. So yeah, that's it. These are cool. On Facebook, I, I see, I saw, I mean, I saw a lot of people saying that this one is nice. This Gusion one. But I don't know if they bought the, this, of course. It's one thing to say it's great on the internet and it's another to buy something but what everyone is buying at least in the branches I went to 
is Mia because she's one of the easiest to get of the heroes even I have her so yeah if you want to try the game yeah I wouldn't really <laughs> suggest the game I you know it's fun I like it I still play the game oh and I didn't notice this was in the background okay let's just leave it there this is not a sponsored video by UFC. Alright, what else can we promote? Okay, we could also promote Kellogg's. Please pay me money. Alright. Yeah, I wouldn't really suggest the game. It's really fun, but... Yeah, I still play it, but... Would I suggest the game? It's just that when... There's a big... Oh, okay. Okay, I think I don't want to talk.